What's going on you guys? It's your boy Big C6 back here again today. I told you guys yesterday had a new video coming. Unboxing video. And uh it's in this box. Let's get let's get it going. You guys will definitely know what this is by the title of the video when you see the video. I just want to make sure off camera real quick. Yes, that's another phone right there that I'm uh updating. Alright, so the phone I have to unbox for you guys today that's going to be my daily device, bong, Boost Mobile Samsung Galaxy A51, and I got this one, thank God, um, it's on sale right now on Boost Mobile for $199.99, you guys can probably hear my dog's roughhousing in the background. The um, phone I'm actually recording this video from right now is the um, the Motorola Moto G Stylus 2021 edition. No, not the 5G, just the normal um, G Stylus 2021. And as you guys can see, this does have the TN, so I'm hoping it's got the new... The new uh, SIM card in it. But yeah. I um, As soon as this phone came out for Boost, I fell in love with it. The last phone I had that was a Samsung was a Samsung Galaxy A20. The A20, I think it was. Alright, we can read the bottom here. I'll let you guys read that. This box, headset, travel adapter. You guys can see. 128 gigabytes. Picture of the phone in the front. The back. Now, for some weird reason, I don't know why, but I thought this was going to come with some kind of silicone over it. But it doesn't. It comes with these little uh, tapes here. We're just going to cut these. Now, I'm not going to tell you guys something. This is literally the most expensive phone I have ever bought in my life. Not even lying. All right, moment of truth. Here it goes. So we have the box, this box here, which probably don't really contain a whole lot. You got your semi jack tool, which I won't be using that one because I have one already that I will be using. You got your instructions in there. Nothing doesn't come with a case, which I have a case and stuff coming from Amazon. Um, so yeah. Pull out the phone here. Got your USB-C cable. Won't be using that. Fast charger. This supports up to 18 watt charge. I probably won't be needing that. I have one. I have a couple of them actually. Oh wow. The phone is a lot smaller than what I expected. You guys can see here the front facing camera. It's 32 megapixels. Nothing over here on the side. At the bottom, we have a headphone jack. Your um, USB-C charging port there. Rear or single fire and speaker. We got the power button, up and down volume rocker. On the top, we have a microphone. And on the back, we have this really nice, I think it's called Prism Black. Fingerprint magnet for sure. We got the Samsung logo here. Then we got the, you know, we got a 48 megapixel camera. I believe a 12 megapixel camera, a 5 megapixel camera, and a 5 megapixel camera. But I'm going to power this on. This is going to be my new daily device. I'll probably have this phone for a while. Because I, for some reason, weird reason, I got my um, Samsung, or the uh, Moto G Stylus 2021 from Walmart. And uh, it actually was working great for a while, and then one day all of a sudden nobody could hear me anymore. Now this phone, like I said, is going to be is the most expensive phone I have ever bought. At, even at one ninety nine, the the Moto G Power or the Moto G Stylus literally cost me like a hundred and forty some dollars. So yeah. Um. I didn't even 
cost me as much as this phone did. This is on sale right now for Boost Mobile for um, $199.99. We're going to actually push start here because I uh, speak English. I agree to this. Next. Um, now it's going to connect me to Wi-Fi or whatever. Hold on a second, guys. Let me, uh... Put my password in for my 5G here. Hopefully this will... Work. <laughs> Sorry. I do, like I said, I do have some screen protectors coming in and a case coming from Boost. Or from Amazon. Now it says activate your device. But, uh... Yeah, this is pretty much the unboxing of the Samsung Galaxy A51 on Boost Mobile. I will update you guys eventually as um the phone goes on, but it's definitely a lot smaller in person than in hand than I thought it was actually going to be. Compared to the uh, Moto G Stylus 2021, this phone is actually pretty small. The screen is smaller. The camera is in the front is a lot smaller. Um, but anyways, guys, stay tuned. I'll probably be giving you guys, you know, camera videos and stuff like that coming from this phone. I'll let you guys know and update, like, everything, all that. But until next time, you guys, it's been your boy, Big C6, and I'm out, y'all. Peace.